traits of a great sales manager. Sooner or later, you wake up one day and realize that your company cannot grow and develop if you, the owner, make all the sales. Either you don't enjoy it enough to be spending all the time on it, or you just get pulled in too many other directions as a business owner. It's therefore time to master one of the hardest functions in business, sales management. There are five things that you need to get right to have a successful sales team. Number one, hiring. Identify, attract, and hire the greatest salespeople. You can't train the wrong people. You are looking for two things when you hire a salesperson. Attitude, your sales team have to have the right self-motivation outlook on life and the ability to live by your company's values. And experience, more specifically, only hire the salespeople that have the direct experience of selling to the same market, to the same volumes that you are expecting. You wouldn't hire an accountant to do your accounting if they hadn't really done accounting before, would you? It's the same for sales. How are you gonna find the right recruits? What is the hiring process to choose the right team? Number two, training. Training needs to be consistent on the what and how of your product service and, and how to get better. Uh, no one's gonna know your product service better than you are. You know them inside and out, backwards and forwards. Depending on the complexity of your business, you need to ensure that the sales team have that power, that knowledge, so they can sell. They need to know the pain of your customer that you're solving. You have a sales manual, right? A document that lists every single feature, benefit, product and service. More importantly, details the sales process, answers every single question a potential customer could ask. Now would be a good time to start one. I promise you it'll make future training of salespeople a lot easier. Three, vampires. Spot the sales vampire, that's the one that is not performing but is sucking the major energy from you, your team, or your organization. You want to run a superior company where your potential sales and customers receive the greatest customer service. You don't want to lose sales to others and you don't want to let your customers down. Therefore, get them out. On a scale of one to 10, how vampirish are each of your sales team? Four, operating system. Identify the operating system. This requires a sales system of motivation and accountability. What is the process to sell a potential prospect and what is the process to gain repeat business from them? What steps do you have to go through and how do you measure what's going on? This is the sales management of sales management. You need to measure what the sales team are doing. Have them report in a non-complex or time-consuming manner. Hold your sales team accountable and openly encourage and reward them. What CRM system are you using? Number five, sales fundamentals. Sales fundamentals are needed for constant improvement. Not the what, how of your product, but the actual sales stuff that your salespeople do. Salespeople have to be constantly selling and this is an area which needs constant development. Verbal, non-verbal, systems in place. You have to keep up with the latest technologies, social norms as they're changing. Keep your team up to date with everything that's going on. Use third-party training if possible. The real question is how you're gonna train your team. So to recap, five traits of a great sales manager, hiring, training, vampires, operating system, sales fundamentals. Get this right and you have made the most important step from a small to a medium-sized business. Happy selling.